So it's like the girl comes out with a really fancy dress and she's got these hard heels on her boots and she dances and, you know. It's kind of like Spanish tap dancing and hey. Uh, sometimes I make the sound of the dance on the guitar. Little dance floor right here, look at this little plastic. Sometimes the fingers dance with the music. stuff together and you got what we call the flamenco style. Here's the dancing rhythm that's very popular in Spain. It's called the Alegrías. Everybody, Alegrías. Alegrías. Alegrías comes from the Spanish word Alegre means joy, happiness, and uh, interesting thing. Listen to this. You know, it's, it's kind of good to find out about other cultures, other countries. Sometimes they do things different than we do, and it's perfectly okay to do things different. People don't have to do things the way we do over here, and we can learn from them. One of the things that's cool is that in the flamenco world in southern Spain, it's different than over here. Over here we hear music and we dance to the music, right? Isn't that what we do? You feel the rhythm and then you move with the music, right? Isn't that right? Okay. Yeah. It's the opposite in Spain. The dancer sets the rhythm and the guitarist has to follow the rhythm of the dancer. That's right. The dancer's feet are like the drumsticks and they're setting the rhythm. And I have to follow what the dancer does. Sometimes she goes real fast, sometimes real slow and dramatic. It's because I'm having to follow her movements. That's how the music follows it. Here's a little alegrías. If we were in Spain, had a flamenco dancer here, I'd follow her. Go something like this. <laughs> <laughs> 